Hello and welcome to a backup plan for a backup plan. Because things break sometimes. We're gonna be playing Pyre. Uh. Not good at ports. Hello. Hi. Sorry. Probably turn off rumble on my controller because <laughs> there is no subtlety for rumble on my controller. Subtlety? What's that? Either full blast or nothing. Pause here? Yes, I can. Controls. Can't turn off. Here. Option. Ah, there. Good. I can give vocabulary. Yeah, pretty much any important words or phrases in this game will be highlighted in red and you can find the definition of them. Alright. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. One of the most organic ways to set the player character's gender, I think. I like how the music suddenly changes. Very dynamic. Depending on who's talking. Mm. <laughs> Rookie's a bit boisterous. Mean. 
This is actually a very interesting book. <laughs> Dang. Oh, multiple. Oh, I can barely read that. Uh, click on inspect. Ah, much better. Uh, the pages of the book will come clear to you as you progress. Freedom! Dare you tamper with forbidden knowledge? So soon after your sentence into exile, is true what the book says. You can be free again. Perhaps not you yourself, but someone worthy of the privilege. You witness now the path towards salvation. You witness the rights, the one way to return to glory. Though in your case, I hardly think it possible. Yet, by the grace of the scribes, it is my duty to inform you anyhow. Hello, Shay. Glory Gatha. Welcome oh, to Tutorial man. Land. Beretusta. Barosta. Rathana. Adira Fe. Celestial orb falls from the heavens when the time is nigh. Exiles conduct the rites as a triumvirate, for they must prove their trust in one another, not just in themselves. The three must act as one. Now plunge into the pyre with the orb and be purified. Yes, the exile Edwin has the way of it. Whoever steps into the flame is banished for a time. His or her cohorts must make do on their own. Oh, but it is not so simple. In the rites, you shall face adversaries whose own freedom is at stake. Beware the aura that surrounds them, as they shall beware yours. The aura is your wrongdoing. Accept it as a part of you. Cast your aura like a stone. Correctly done. Again, just so. A glorious performance, I admit. More than I expected from the likes of you. Grasp the orb once more. The orb absorbs the aura. Then the orb quenches the flame. Now I 
say jump. Not quite. Into the flames. <laughs> Adversary's pyre, whilst yours yet burns. Edwin plunged into their pyre. Bone vanished. Beyond us, banished to the last. Gotcha. Joe Dariel doused the adversary's flames. Zap. So essentially, you'll notice of your initial party, Dariel is strong but slow. Rookie is quick but weak, and Edward is in the middle. It's complete. There, dear reader. Now you understand. Or do you? The rest of the party is a bit more this complicated was but than a that. Of that which lies ahead. I would tell you to turn back. You clearly won't. Cut down your hope. But all those such as you, you never listen. Figured as much. <laughs> I'll be right back. Check on something. Alright, I'm back. Hello, back. The Ridge of Gold. Concilia. Indaratarios. <laughs> Tamaririos ta. Bravo, Stafrati. 
Kereamios. Lorio Matas. La fi. Aderas. Estadium. Hmm. Go up. We might find some help. But we also might attract attention. If we go down, we'll avoid attention, but we might get stuck. What do you think? As <laughs> someone who's done both these options, I'm not really going to say anything. There's no bad choice here? With a lot of these choices, it's not... There's no bad choice, there's just what perk do you get? Always good to have friends back you up. So I'll go with the with choice. Okay, I can tell you now the the two options in this case are incredibly similar. Okay. Later choices do carry more weight. A parcel. Uh, you can highlight uh, objects such as yellow items as well to figure out what they are. It's a parcel, I like it. It's a, it's a, it's vendor trash. So selling item. Oh. So yeah, you've now got the first actual page in the book, and there's someone who wants to talk to you. First exile. This book contains a lot of lore. Hey, what's up? Like that's it. Mm -hmm. You can actually now enter the common room. Ah, where I can pick my character. Also, you can find information about what, well, you can see what you know about them. Might as well commence the right. Three. 
Athena. The stars align at last. You reach the ridge of Gaul at the appointed time, and your triumvirate is ready. Your adversaries in the rites this eve shall be the accusers. Whosoever pyre yet burns once the right, other so extinguished a lot of things in the shall way. step closer mm -hmm. to freedom. <clears throat> now let the rites commence. It seems to be three humans, so mm -hmm. gotta keep my distance. Begin. Oh, you'll notice that all aur uh, auras get bigger when they're combined. Way too close. <laughs> Users underestimated you. Edwin doused the adversary's flames. Azuria Southern Tusta. It seems that you have flustered the accusers. Southern Tusta. Arunka. Have you any idea what that lend uh, here's your introduction to, to throw it. Exile, hmm? <laughs> I think somebody get the orb. <laughs> <laughs> I'd, I'd still advise you throw it in. Throwing it in does something interesting. Okay. Now toward their flames. Now. Gotcha. Daring display. Uh, now if you throw it in. Yep. into the yep. flames like that. You elude banishment using such tricks. Ah. Throwing in is harder and generally does less damage, but you don't get the round banishment. I don't mind losing a character for a turn. Oh, uh, you will later. Sorry. Ah, dang it. Well, I got two and one, so... Mm-hmm. You've got a lovely commentary. But. Sorry, I'm focusing. You got a lovely commentary as well. Oh, I, oh I, thought you, I thought you were talking about how I wasn't talking at all. No, I was, I was talking about the voices commentary. Which for now is the character's actual name, by the way. Gotcha. And it is done. You have prevailed. Rejoice then in your single fleet. Um, okay, this one I should add. There is ten. Like, the non English text of uh, speech in this game is technically formulated around something like a language. 
Sorry. Bask now Do you want me to go? <laughs> no. What? No. The exile Jodariel has gained I don't know what to say sometimes. Neither do I. The enlightened can regain their Welcome to a skill system. This one. This one. The demon scribe bestows his favor. Conceal Tavidias. Conceal Tavidias. Ligaratus. All right, sure. Kisantirna. No, probably this one's important. Some terras. All right, sure. Get me in the oldest star and bonus mission. Why can't I? No, um, that's just one of the background stars. It'll become more important later. Ah, uh, look different from all the others. So now we're going to give me the the desk star. Uh, je me... I know it's weird pronunciation. Is... Hey, another conversation. Ruki status right there. Okay, I've, I've heard about this 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 choice, I think. This conversation. Not the conversation, but I've heard about this choice. What does that mean again? Um, mischievous, like sort of I not think to no good. He looks fine. I think he looks fine. That's what I'm gonna say. <laughs> All right, plus one hope. That's good. Um, uh, which one does hope do? I think hope receive. Uh, yeah, hope is respawn speed. Uh, that's good. Uh, quickness is movement speed, glorious pyre damage, and wait. the other one is aura size. Where's page two? Oh wait, I'm, I'm dead, stupid, never mind. There's page two. <laughs> uh, after this chap- after the first major chapter of the game, the pages won't unlock in order. <laughs> oh, that's- that's great. Imps everywhere. Pokemon. Alright, can you? Oh, 
Off to the valley. I guess that's our only choice. Mm-hmm. Leap! It's a very impressive wagon. Hi. I heard the doorbell. I'll be right back. I don't know if I actually heard the. Door I'll be right back. I'm gonna see if, the, if that was the. Door if I heard the doorbell. Was it the doorbell? I don't know. It could have been the game. Could have been the dog. Alright, I'm back. There was nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it happens. There's one particular commentary on one of the names that is rather funny. <laughs> this one can't possibly be right. <laughs> I love how all of these have different, uh... Mm-hmm. I'm gonna guess this one. It, it, there's no guess. Whichever one you pick, she's happy oh. with.
And she fell asleep. What a strange person. Mm. Options. Uh, welcome to vocations. Free time events. All right. Uh, so, foraging for resources gives you vendor trash. Studying the book gives you a permanent party stat boost, and studying with someone else increases their enlightenment. Hmm. Check everyone's enlightenment. That might be. Edmund's pretty close to leveling. How much would you say? say huh? Hmm? How much would you say it usually gives the... I wouldn't exactly know, because I mostly study the book. That's fair. That permanent step up for everyone, so... Yeah, so studying the book once in a certain category will mean that everyone has one more in that stat permanently. Choices, choices. I assume studying private is probably the best choice. You can only do it eight times, so it gets done pretty quickly. Ah, fair enough. So I'll take care of the, I'll get that out of the way first, then. Or I'll, I'll, I'll alternate it with uh, mm. leveling anyone that needs attention, or giving anyone that needs attention and enlightenment. Mm-hmm. Oh, each point in hope slightly reduces your fellow... Point in quickness? Yes. Uh, this one. Go for presents first. Mm -hmm. So you have level one tenacity. All right. Back on the road. <clears throat> Options are glue hive. Thanks, speed. Why is there? Why can't I? Oh, that's the location. Uh, I'm yeah. always I'm always good for more speed. Oh wait, one. Oh uh, wait, no, no. I thought it was increasing speed or strength. No, she's just. pick now. I will go fall flat.
Aha! Plus one quickness to everyone. Perfect. That's a temporary buff. Yeah, it says for the next right, so... Mm. It's something. Yeah. Alright, we've yeah, arrived lot... I'm oh, sorry, you first. A lot of dialogue, a lot of paths like that will offer something like that, where it will be one route gives you one temporary buff, or another route gives you resources, or anything like that. Door. Oh, and a new page. And hmm. a new... Right. So you learned a bit about headwind. It's at the store. These are basically accessories. Yeah, every um, every member of your uh, team can equip one at a time, etc., etc. Sir. He kind of goes on and on a bit. All right. Now it's right time. Who are we fighting this time? All right, it's go time. Stars align once more. Reader, what brings you to the spring of Jomia? Why, it must have been the stars. Although it seems that your triumvirate now numbers four exiles, not the expected three. 
The rules of the rites were not created for you to dispatch. Prepare now to confront the fate. They still honor the traditions of the scribes and surely have been longing for this chance. But first, you have a choice to make. Thank you. I hope it's a nice old man. Almost the same stats. Yeah, it's just uh, she's a little quicker. You can also view your adversary's yeah. bios by hitting the um, the shadow, the silhouette uh, button. I uh, can talk. Two humans. Uh... Right, this will work. It is done. Now the first dousing. Ooh, thing. thing. A boon come from the stars themselves. Holy cow. Remember, curse can move very quickly. Stand not in glory's path. They told me to click the moon drop, so I did. But one valid tactic is to intentionally throw the orb to your uh, opponent. Ah, uh, so I can. Yeah, I th I th that's what I was trying to do. Is I was trying to throw the orb away from them so that I could surprise them with a spirit with a spirit attack, but clearly didn't work. Yeah, that can be risky. What I mean is intentionally throw it so they catch it and therefore they their aura dissolves. The fires wane. The stifled effort. Ha! 
He's moving toward me, out of the way. Whoops. Whoops. I mean, you got rid of them. Nice jump. Go, 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 go. Damn it. So close. A deadly thwarted drive. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah, dude. Nah. Gotcha. The orb is up. Shut the seal. And also, yeah, passing the orb is a very important strategy too. Dorbert dispatched with ease. Nice dodge. Nice enough. Yeah, yeah. The uh, the eyes start to stop playing around now. Remember everything you hold dear. Your victory is at hand. There. Close. Uh, gotcha. I should tell you right now, you carry on in the story even if you lose. Yeah, that's what, that's what the it said at the beginning that even if you lost, it didn't. It, 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 you can still continue. Mm -hmm. In fact, in True Nightwings, that's the way you have to play the game. What do you mean? You're not allowed. Uh, you're not allowed to restart rights or reload saves. You have to keep going. No matter what your result is. There is much to learn from this experience. Um, you'll notice Hedwin gained a little bit of green experience. That is because, Is that what the... Is that what the what? Is that what the... Is the green experience... Is the, is the green experience gained when you do the study together thing? No, green experience um, is... It's essentially bonus experience for the next time they actually do participate. Like it, it, it boosts their experience by by ten percent or something when they gained until that limit. How long would you get, get how long would you say this game is? Mm, really just depend on what you do with it. Um Give me a moment. <laughs> Uh, in total, you'll play 26 matches. That should give you an idea. Now we're going east. The Midnight Star. Star of Hope. What, what minstrel person? 
I don't remember seeing anyone. Uh, he was there. I will say, uh, for example, if you chose to exclude Jadariel, she would take her temporary hope debuff. Yeah, I figured if I, yeah, I, that was me. I assume that, uh, I assume that, I... Yeah, that a bunch of other, that the other people would as well. I'm not sure. I haven't obviously played the game that many times, but I know Jadariel takes a hope debuff. Hello. Went through fall flats. Let's see. Let's go through Blue Hive and see if there's anything over there. No way the minstrel would have just gone the same way we already came. Is All right, let's see what's prepare for the night. Elders, lots of them. Yeah. Uh, Shy, thank you for uh, hosting. That's what we're gonna do. What? Oh, that. Sorry, I got confused. <laughs> Alright, prepare for Howlers. This is a chance to learn about phase, more specific mechanics, and to earn some free money. Down. They put an area of slow down. There we go. So if you time her casting correctly, she casts further and quicker. Oh, I see. Like that. And right it looks like. Flashes. Yeah. Similar to some of the weapons in Bastion. Mm hmm. Same for her jump. God damn it.
I'm very good at timing the jump. The jump is very hard to time. 55 gold though, not too bad. Ah, a small, another one. Okay. He's got a ribbon on him. Keep it. Yay. <clears throat> what? Nothing. Sorry, I'm just rearranging myself. Okay, someone that knows his way around. Good. Thank you. Alright. Alright, go. Nice to meet you. as well. Ah, so I can uh, play the soundtrack through here. Nice. Uh, acoustic versions of the soundtrack.
small Pegasian flies. Yeah. What are our powdy flies? Am I starting a little pentacle in time? Ooh, thank you. Uh, yeah, so Stardust increases the uh, power of any talisman you already have. Oh, so you can now shut them up. I'm good. That might be useful. Take cash and coal. And the lucrative contract. The lucrative contract is a nice way of making money early game. I'll give. Alright, thank you. Right, I think I'll do I think I'll do this match and then we'll end the stream. Mm-hmm. Ah oh, hi. Welcome to many people's favorite well my personal favorite train for it. Hi. Something tells me his team plays very aggressively. But probably, but probably so aggressively that they leave themselves open. I think they should keep that in mind. Welcome, dear reader, to the splendors of the accursed cairn of Aub. Aub. You shall find the downside grows less pleasant from this point. But first, there's a tradition to uphold. This time you stand against the dissidents. Even now they hunger to defeat you. Yeah, you'll notice that each triangle also has its own theme music. Their freedom, but to deny you yours. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, um, some train, uh, some of your party will be barred from partaking in certain rights at all. Oh, cool! And here's your new party member. We needed, I needed, a, I needed someone that was fast. So why not a little, a little? Well, speed. imps are interesting. They don't do normal casts. Well, they're about to show me. <laughs> ah, so instead of jumping, you fly. So used to having to tap a bunch to I dash in the air, and I can explode. Yeah, he can banish in a wide range radius, but he banishes himself in the process. I cannot dash while I am jumping. Makes sense. All right. Who shall strive for freedom? Go. Joe Dial. 
Gusto. Tizo. And Edwin. Edwin. Shiru Sama. No. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Commence! Whoa, whoa, the ice moves. Oh, the whole plane is icy. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Yeah, those things move. Have fun. Okay, get me from up here. All right, and they have the same amount of fire banishment as the normal be as the other beast tribe. Huh. I don't, I'm insistent. <laughs> Sorry. That's fine. I'm used to being corrected on stuff like that. We. Oh, he tackled me! Ah! Wow, that was sweet. No sign of the dissidents for now. Now our. You guys are very apt on trying to get me first before I get the old... Uh, mm -hmm. Oh, ran right into that one. Luckily I can just get the drop on them, quite literally, with Dizzo. I also thought they had me. Oh dear. Oh well, at least they're only- yeah, they're- Oh, Snowy joined the part. Hi, Snowy. <laughs> Hi, ah, yeah. Snowy. I need to question, uh, uh Mr. Uh, the Captain of the Froze and Man. What? About a certain, uh, Dremel. Not Last now. Night. Can we wait till after yes. the stream? No, this is the perfect time. <laughs> Alright, fine. Okay. This is the perfect time. So, I'm going to recount. What you said, uh, dunk. And read it. I'm gonna read it out now, okay? Uh, score, keep notes, okay? Why am I dragging being dragged? No, get, no, get oh, a notepad goodness. now. Take notes. I came here to watch some sports ball. No, notes. Anyway, just get, get on with it. Alright, so, let's, here, here's the dream that you told, okay? I had a dream that ended really weirdly. It ended with someone that sounded like Snowy giving me a box of turtles, but one of the turtles was very obviously a small kitten covered in lettuce leaves. We had a small argument about it before I woke up. Are you saying that that's not something you would do? This is exactly something I would do. I literally said that's the next thing I said. I said I, is that I th is that I, is that coin is that I think Snowy would do this given enough time and money. <laughs> As I say, it's a vision of the future. <laughs> and, then, and, then, and I realize they don't even have to be real turtles. They can just be plush ones, but the cat would probably be the real thing. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you want to know why I you have You have said multiple times that you would give me kittens, so... I would. I would. I would give you kittens in a heartbeat. But, uh, do you want to... Do you want to know my response to this? The only thing I can come up with, okay? <laughs> I would... I would win this argument by saying the following. That kitten was told he could be anything. 
They want to be a turtle. I mean, I would still take the kitten no matter what you said, but... Cause it's, He's a turtle. It's, it's, a, it's a gift. <laughs> and the kitten wanted to wear lettuce because, uh... uh Okay. I don't know why Jeffrey wanted to wear lettuce, but he's wearing lettuce. The rights do tend name to the teach something he's just, Why don't- This is what kitten should be mentioned. I already named them. Now I'm uh, attached to Jeffrey. Alright, anyway, Pyre. I beat the speed demons or whatever. Okay. Dissidents. Yeah, Jeffrey, come back! You can blame it all on Freeze. He didn't believe in your ability to be a turtle. Go on. Jeffrey. Oh shit, there's a third Lucius game. You, Lu Lucius 3. Electric Murder Blue. Hmm. <laughs> Have you ever wanted to play as Satan Child? No, not particularly. Well, now you can. In the Lucius D make. With Lucius now in hand, the Master General you can. Reveals his strategy. It, it, it's the uh, banana. You can banana. The rights first hand yep. Mm -hmm. and be inspired. Yep. I, I know words. I know what I would do. I know. I know concepts. I can control the world with my brain. All right, let's see what is. Okay. That night, all of the Disney movie sequels were deleted. Yes, see, I, I have saved. One. I've saved the world from devastation, to unite all people within our nation. Until the next right. To denounce the evils of truth and love, to extend our reach from the stars to the stars above. I'm surprised. I'm honestly surprised Cinnamon didn't just randomly show up. Mm hmm. Snowy! Sin! Uh, wait, who's our Meowth? Uh, uh, Waffle. Waffle! <laughs> yes! Steamed waffles, I don't know. <laughs> waffle is. Uh, Sin has already claimed Waffle as his child, so. Alright. Let me just fin let me finish this dialogue stuff and then finish the stream. See, what you need to do is play Lego. You need to play Lego the Hobbit. You know, I got that. I, I bought a... I think it was... Fan, fanati, f, f, fanatical? Uh, Wait, is some bundle doing their winter sale now? Yeah, I think so. No, I, I think this is actually... Part, I think this is part of the... The... WB sale. I'm just, I might check that out in a bit. Oh, fan I Fanatical, that's what it was. Uh, Fanatical's doing a mystery bundle thing, and it was like 10 games for 7 bucks, and I got uh, a bunch of good games out of it, including Geometry Wars 3. Nice. <laughs> you can now war on geometry. Actually, I probably need that because I'm in geometry right now, and it's, it's oh, I wish, really I, aggravating. I wish it actually taught you geometry. That'd be useful. No, you just shoot geometry problems. All right. See what our next location Freeze. is, and then we'll end the Freeze. stream. Freeze! You do not need an education in geometry, you need to shoot geometry. No, we need to look at the stars, that's what we need to do. I mean, I... I could sing Sonic songs in my goofy again. voice. I could do that again. The flagging hands. Gorsh! Gorsh Freeze! The flagging hands! Freeze? Heard you. Beating right now. Oh, literature. All right. Got to end in this place. Yes, it is. This is the perfect time to end, like with a goofy voice. Gorge. Also, mm. of course, of course, right before I end, some uh, in Steam, someone is playing the Stanley Parable. Uh huh. Well, I want a parable Stanley. Also, I just did you realized. Hear, did it you is... hear about the new version yeah, of that is... coming out? Yeah, I Wait, heard what? it was a new version, and yeah, it's supposed uh, to celebrate the fact that you can now technically get an achievement in the game. Uh, Stanley Parable, I think it's Ultra Deluxe. It's coming to consoles yeah. with a bunch of. I think of... the reason they're doing that is mainly because console port, and second, it's also to celebrate the anniversary of, an of a joke achievement in that game. 
mm -hmm. which was not to play the game for five years, and this is the earliest you could te you could theoretically get that achievement. Sure it is. Sure your problem is gonna go away soon. All right. Don't okay. you want the achievement of not playing the game for five years? All right. Time All right. to end the stream. Time to end the stream. Wow, I, I came in and I ended the stream with my voice. Good job. Mm -hmm. Uh, I did it. Uh, do you have any? Do you guys have anything to promote? Uh, Basically. my boyfriend. <laughs> he is a person, and uh, I promoted him. Done. We're down here, right? Okay. Uh, all right. Uh, if uh, yeah. For those who are. Okay, sorry. Uh, for those who are new to the stream, Tuesday, Thursday, Friday, 4 to 6 Pacific Standard Time. Tuesday, Thursday is normally a playthrough. I guess right now it's either going to be Hollow Knight or Pyre, uh, depending on who's available. Uh, Friday is usually Final Fantasy VIII. Uh, for the, uh, if you liked what you watched, you can follow. If you really liked what you watched, you can subscribe uh, to get... Uh, sorry, my brain is everywhere right now. <laughs> Uh, subscribe to get access to the Discord, monthly game session, monthly multiplayer sessions, a chance to pick a game for me to play. Wait, and... monthly multiplayer sessions? Yeah. Wait, it's now a subscriber only Discord? No. Shit. You can you can, okay if you subscribe to get in, you're there. You can be there. You can be there as long as you want. If you even if you're unsubscribed. Oh, so now now we're gonna have people loitering on our server. I don't care. <laughs> but people I keep. Wanna... I try to keep it clean. People want to loiter on my server. Glass. Try to sweep up the broken glass. As long as glass. they don't do anything. Anyway, you also get this nice emote. It's a very nice emote. It's, uh, yeah, it tune in on it. Friday for more Final Fantasy VIII. Until next time, good night, everybody. Good night.